ein deutsches U-Boot auf Heimfahrt im Nordmeer. This is one of the last surviving U-boats in the world. Standing sadly in a quiet corner of Birkenhead Docks, Liverpool, U-534 presents a melancholy sight, a ghost of the menacing craft which once hunted with the deadly wolf packs. We can still clearly see the impact of the marks left by the depth charges, which sank her on the second last day of World War II. U-534 was hit on the surface by British depth charge, which lodged in the conning tower and then exploded, rendering the ship impotent. A second depth charge blew in the side of the craft. Fortunately, all of the crew escaped the sinking. Although three crew members later died of exposure, U-534 was not designated as a war grave. So 50 years after her sinking, she was salvaged and brought to the surface. Ironically, she was taken to England to rest in the home of her greatest enemy. Today, for the first time, a camera crew is being allowed to film inside the U-534. 50 years on the seabed have taken their toll on the U-534, but the main features are unmistakable. These are the deadly torpedo tubes, which once spelt death for Allied ships. And this is the one toilet, which had to serve the needs of 50 men on board. The ravages of time and tide have given the interior of U-534 a fantastic quality. The tangle of steel and equipment looks almost like a piece of modern avant-garde art. But with a little imagination, it is not too difficult to roll back the years to the glory days of the early 1940s, when ships like the U-534 were masters of the Atlantic.